what's going on guys we got a chest day here uh, this video footage is a little old it's just a little old I want to say maybe like a week ago um, you know, we had chest I'm just gonna narrate here a bit so usually starting off with just like a plate on each side for warm-up more well, like the first warm-up set because uh, before we ever, before I even hit chest, you know, I like to warm up the shoulders. And warming up the shoulders is like rotator cuff, you know, lateral raises, uh, front raises, you know, things like that. Just throwing your arms around. Uh, and then sometimes I'll do push-ups. If not, then, you know, just go straight into like the first set, which is a plate on each side. Second set, usually a plate in 25, you know, just adding more weight. And then third set, sometimes they'll be the same one, you know, just get a good pump in there. So what, uh, this, well for chest, I don't know, it switches off, you know, like some days it'll be, it'll, I'll just feel like lifting heavy, you know, and just try to aim for like two plates or a little over two plates. Uh, like this set right here, I believe this is the fourth set. This is two plates on each side. Um, don't remember how much I hit it for, I want to say maybe like four. Four, six, maybe. And it looks like four. Four, five. Four and a half. Anyway. You know, so there's the heavy days. Um, right now, it's, it's I'm kind of like trying to work on, on getting that separation in the chest, you know, like between, like in the mid chest. Well, not like, uh, how can I say this? for the center of the body, you know, like the pec separation, uh, you know, especially now that they're losing more fat, you know, just it's, it's starting to, definition starting to show a little bit more and, you know, just pushing that little extra uh, definition in there. Uh, but for now, usually, you know, starting off with like upper chest, uh, not like this video where, you know, went straight into flat bench. But I feel like flat bench is, is good for like just overall chest, you know? Um, and funny thing is like at the gyms, I really don't see people emphasizing too much on the lower chest, you know, like when they do decline. Usually that machine is, is open, that that bench is open. Um, but actually, I think we might start doing uh, a few sets in those, maybe like three to four sets whenever I hit chest. So... You know, after the two plates, after hitting it heavy, you just like to drop the weight. You just kind of like pyramid down, you know, pyramid back down. And then sometimes we'll do like drop sets. So here we went back to a plate on each side or 90 pounds plus the bar. Which will equate to, what was it, three, about 130, I want to say. Yeah. And incline bench, of course. Usually for this one, I don't really go over two plates total. You know, like a plate on each side. Usually I'll just stay here. Um, I think the most I do is like a plate in 25. You know, upper chest is a little weaker. But that's why, you know, you should put a little bit more emphasis. You know, just bring out the weak points. Um, especially, I mean, my chest overall is pretty weak. I don't want to say it's, it's lagging. So. And then just a tip for you guys, like uh, whenever you feel like, you know, you're lifting heavy, you know, and you're pushing the muscles, uh, right between the sets, it's a good idea either to, you know, press your palms together, arms stretched out in front of you, press some palms together, um, you know, get the squeeze in the chest you know, between sets. It just keeps the blood flowing, keeps the blood pumping into that muscle. Um, so you get more of a pump there, that way. That's one way of doing it. Uh, a different alternative way, or even like a, just a different way completely that you can also do, uh, is just do push-ups between sets. You know, like finish your set, take about 10, 20 second rest, you know, do a push-ups. Maybe your buddy's doing his set, you know. Um, once he's done, you know, you're pumped chest is pumped and you know go back into to doing the um, the benching 
It's, it's pretty good stuff. Um, also, been focusing a lot on doing uh, dumbbells. You know, because I feel like you get more concentration, more you're able to get more squeeze out of them. Uh, other than you know, just doing regular barbell bench press. Uh, I feel like, yeah, it's, it's good for size and everything, but when you're really trying to get into the muscle fibers, I feel like this is the best way. And a lot of people agree, you know, like, it's, it's the best way. Plus, you're using muscle fibers that, you know, for stabilization, which you're bringing in more muscle fibers than what you normally would use. And then another good exercise for the upper chest. Uh, I'm not sure if you've seen, like, that, uh, that kind of, like, V that forms at the upper chest. This is a really good one. Uh, there's different variations of doing this. A lot of people prefer not doing it this way, where you know you're laying flat on the bench. That's um, you know, uh, ver uh, what do you call it? Parallel to it, but they actually like like lying perpendicular, or just like uh, pretty much supporting their back on the bench, uh, and then you know doing it that way. I feel like it's a little trickier, and it just takes a little bit more off of it, but out of it actually yeah I prefer doing this this way and there goes the hat yep I think wearing a hat when you're benching um, or even working out triceps like if you're doing like the tricep extension like overhead it's just it, it, it sucks you know always gets in the way but yeah, it's whatever And for these, usually it's anywhere from like three sets minimum, four sets max. You know, it's it's not that. I mean, you know, like that's that small portion of you know your upper chest isn't even that big, so you really don't need that much emphasis in it. But you know. oh, and by the way, that exercise you can also do when you're doing uh, lats. It's just, it's called lat uh, lat pullover, um, dumbbell pullover, lat. Dumbbell pull over. And then we had to stick to doing this machine because uh the it was I think this was Saturday. And it was really packed, the gym was pretty packed. And um the the other cables were you know taken. So yeah, you gotta make do with what you got, you know. Oh and then this right here, you know, battery died. Uh but actually before this we would dead hit shoulders. So it was kind of like taking a break between that and the cables. It was pretty good. Well, I'll leave you with the rest of the video. Cool. Uh, if anything, just you know, comment, subscribe, leave your comments in the comment section below. And um, you know, I'm still waiting for more comments. You know, I, I get questions here and there, but it's not in my videos. It's just like out of YouTube, you know. So I'll keep you posted. Cool. I hope to hear from you guys soon. And take it easy. Peace.